friends. Welcome back to my home. If we're meeting for the first time, my name's Rebecca. Today, we are going to be decorating my entry in my living room for the summer. Now, my summer theme is called Vintage Blue, and I have tried to do as much as I could in finding some vintage blue items to do that decorating for you. A lot of what I found was Amazon.com, and I already had a few items, a few of the vintage items on hand, but I'm gonna show you how I use those and incorporate them in my summer decorating. I appreciate each and every one of you. I love you guys, so let's go ahead and get decorating. The pillows that I had on my sofa for spring were just too flat. So I found these feather down pillows from Amazon and I believe they were a little on the pricey side. You guys have to let me know. I paid $43 for the two pillows. They're 20 by 20 inch. And then I found these pillow covers in the navy blue ticking, which I thought would be great for my summer theme of vintage blue. Do you ever find something that you just really like and you don't want to change it out? That's what I have on the top of my end tables. For the bottom, I did add my dough bowls, so if I find some summer treasures, I'll have an empty spot ready for those summer treasures to go in. And over here, uh, again, I like what I have on the top. I don't want to change it out. I added a basket in the back there. And again, if I find some more summer treasures, I have a place ready for it. Now over here on my door, I'm gonna leave that lantern hanging there for the summer. But over on my door, I did find these vintage blue stripe curtains from Amazon. And I'm gonna give you a close up. It's not a total white, it's like an off-white with the vintage blue. This is my summer living room. And my entry. Over here in my living room, I have decided to leave my little lamp on the table. That is my husband's grandfather's old Bible. And I just added some baby's breath that I got from Amazon in a little creamer, ironstone creamer that I already had on hand. This chair is originally gonna go out of here, but for now, I have taken the couple of pillows that I had for spring on my sofa and I put them over here with the quilt. Now this quilt is one that my husband's grandmother had made and it is in a country blue print, but it needs some help. I have some fabric laying here I thought might go with it and let me just show you why. Over here on this side, it has frayed out, guys, over the many, many years. The edges have frayed out. So I'm gonna try to match up some of this country blue fabric. And if I can't find exactly what I want, I thought I might bleach it out a little bit so that it will uh, match this blue 
and do redo a large binding uh, around this. So I don't know, I want to try to make it last as long as we can. Beautiful, beautiful quilt. And guys, this is hand stitched. It's not machine. Now, the squares may have been maybe machine sewn. I can't see the inside of that. But anyway, beautiful, beautiful quilt. So I'm hoping to work on that a little bit. And But I thought I would bring that out for the summer with the blue and white because my theme this year is vintage blue and that is definitely a vintage blue guys moving on around to my mantle i like this so much guys i'm going to leave it for summer uh, i still have the little bird springtime or summer and i have not changed anything out up there on my mantle, I liked it so much and I like the white florals for the summer. So I'm gonna leave those, I think, till the fall. And then over here, I just took out uh, the, on my TV stand, just took out uh, the bunnies for the spring and left everything else. In my lantern, I haven't changed anything there either. I think I can go right through summer with that aqua jar. And over here on my other end table, I still really like these little wooden vases that I got from Hobby Lobby years ago. But I am really loving the pillows on my sofa for summer. And I thought that the vintage ticking would go with my vintage blue for this season. So I will link all of that information if it's something you're looking for. I do have it in my Amazon storefront uh, under summer decorating or summer 2023. You'll see it if you go over there. So let's move on over to the entry. here in my entry on my console it is just so simple I got the cloche from Michaels and I had the little terracotta pots in it for the spring along with a uh, concrete bunny but this time I was looking for blue and white vintage cups to go in there I was not able to find any but I realized that I had a couple of these on hand. I had thought about bringing these out for the spring, but I thought I'm doing a vintage, of course, vintage blue, nothing blue about those, but a vintage summer. And then on the bottom, not too much has changed. And I just added some of the thistles for the summertime in that basket along with the light colored green and then the farmer's market pillow that i ordered online i can't remember where i got it from it's in a video in the past if i can find it i'll link it below and then let's move on over to the bench at my entry so over here guys i have a blue i got this from amazon and it is a blue and white throw also found from amazon uh, this pillow cover it's a 12 by 20 and it goes over just a pillow that i already had just a pillow feel if you have one that has a different wording on it uh, you can add that in there but again my theme was vintage blue so this is what i have picked and to go with my vintage theme, I have a crock full of daisies. Now let's go over my entry at my bench. 
My arches stay up there. That farm charm sign will come down when I redo my bedroom that's going in there. And the wreath I got from Hobby Lobby online. And I still like those up there, so I'm gonna leave them for the summer. I did change out, instead of tulips in the basket, I have some little, what looks like to be air plants. They're not real. And I picked those up from Hobby Lobby. Uh, the basket, the woven, large woven baskets from Hobby Lobby, the small ones from Amazon. And then down on the bench area, I have the blue throw. I'm leaving my tree over there in my large crock. I added some aqua jars for the summer, and I love the daisies in the crock. And on the floor, I added something different. This was a vintage blue rug. I ordered this from Amazon.com. You can find it in my Amazon storefront. And the little uh, flyer bench is, I got it on clearance at Hobby Lobby. And then the porcelain vase. If I use real flyers, I have one of the Dollar Tree vases that I set down in there. But these are faux hydrangeas. And I got those from Hobby Lobby this year. I love them. They're beautiful. And I thought that would make a grand entrance when somebody comes in my front door.